Thaumagist is the astrologist. Her astrology column in the Steambird is well known among Ratawahi's scholars. Her articles always cover super specialized topics, but can still be appreciated by non-academics. That's no easy feat. <gasps> huh? Her name seems to just roll off my tongue? Oh, uh, that's just because I, I have a lot of respect for uh, amazing people. Oh, I know who you're talking about. Lisa Minchi, the legendary Spontamod prodigy who graduated in just two years. If only I had her brains. Huh? You met her in person when you were in Mondstadt? R really So, what's her studying process like? What books does she read and what kind of work does she do? Where, where should I start if I, if I want to learn from her? Oh, d Dory. <clears throat> I, I took the plunge and bought something from her once. She looked euphoric as I was settling the bill. I think she assumed I was some sort of mega rich person. Kept relentlessly sending product ads to me in the mail afterwards. <laughs> Biggest mistake of my life! I paid such a huge price for it. Cause not only did I spend all of my scholarship money in one go, but for most of the next year I had to survive mainly on cheap vegetables. And I couldn't buy textbooks unless they were on sale. <laughs> The General Mahamatra is really good at Genius Invocation TCG? Oh, I wonder if... <laughs> I mean, if I ever got the chance, maybe I could play a game with him. Card games like Genius Invocation TCG are always easier when <laughs> you're good at mental math, so... Actually, I... I don't know, but <laughs> I might not necessarily lose to him. Has Professor Farazan managed to get any students? People from the Haravatat Darshan say that she always has difficulty getting funding for her projects, so it's hard for her to attract students too. Hmm. Dear mighty god of wisdom, I've been studying late into the night for days on end. Please let me pass this exam. Please. Please.